<laughs> just, I, I walked into the grid today just expecting to be terribly savage, and it's working today. It's working pretty well. Um, so yeah, guys, we're running into this match. Game one, Spongy playing the patented Kirby. Uh, Firebuster, though, going with Falcon and instantly getting down aired off stage. Unfortunate. He was going for that quick kill on Spongy, and it just didn't work out for him. That was, uh, that's really bad. Because Spongy can run away with this now, but it seems like Firebuster has a quick grip on what he wants to do. Takes that stock, no problem. So let's see what's going on. Nice. Solid neutral, but Spongy's going to break that with the first bit of action already. Got a bunch of goons over to my left just yelling about something. I don't even know. But there we go. Wow, Fireblaster. Going quickly with that. Uh, Spongy dunking him down pretty deep. He made him just come back. That's Kirby for you, everybody. Kirby is the comeback king. All right, Falcon. Trying to get something started. Nothing really solid has been thrown out in terms of combos. Um, it seems like this is a lot of just uh, one-hit combos into getting them off stage as best they can. But that's just kind of how you have to play this game. Like, look at that. Just spawns back with a downer back air super combo. Here we go. Back throw. That's going to kill. These guys keeping this super close. All right. Again, solid neutral game being played by both these guys. None of them want to just run in there expectantly. Or, uh, like too uh, recklessly, I guess, I think is the word. There we go. I get paid for this, folks. I don't. But, <laughs> um, yeah, they don't want to run in recklessly and just get hit. Because that could be an easy stock for either of them. Just like that, we almost had a shield break right before our eyes. Luckily, uh, Fire Blaster managing to salvage it. It's going to be a tough return. Yeah. Unfortunately, Spongy just covered the option. Fire Blaster was not able to go. He was either going to get down there or he was just going to lose. All right. I don't know if you guys have ever heard of the Falcon Magnet Hug, but that was exactly what we just saw there. And that worked out splendidly. Again, super close game. Every single stock has been back, forth, back, forth. Incredible. Fire Blaster putting on some pressure just below Spongy right now. Throwing out some good moves, putting pressure on that platform. Making sure Spongy's not content with just sitting there. Down air, gonna connect. Unfortunately, Spongy's still open to the Kaz page in the book. He's not flip open the Fire Blaster for these reads. You gotta make sure he's on the right chapter. Fire Blaster, getting a little something started. Going out there. Trying to go out there as much as he can. Ooh, solid down air by Fire Blaster. Fake, taking that stock. That was really, really nice. I like that. That down air was really well. So, game two. Seems like Fire Blaster most likely going to stay uh, with his choice there of Falcon. I appreciate that. That was a really that was a close match, man. Close, close, close. Let's see what they can do for game uh, game two here. All right. Bungie kind of throwing out some backers. Just throwing out the hitboxes, making sure that Fire Blaster can't approach. Ooh. There we go. It seems like his, uh, his book got opened to the right chapter this time. Throwing that up there out. Ooh, down tilt. Not going to make it back, though. Spongy getting his name on the board now. All right. Again, Spongy getting a lot of stuff started here. And just like that, another stock. Spongy has definitely opened up the correct chapter of this book. He's getting these reads. He's knowing what he wants to do. And it's looking good. Up B. Yep. Not going to connect. Uh, not going to kill yet. But putting Spongy in an awkward spot here. Now he's got to recover as best he can, but he ends up getting a hit with an A move. I couldn't see what move that was. Okay. Fire Blaster, making sure that if he got hugged, he was low enough to where he's going to stage spike him. So that was pretty good. I like that option. And again, just the neutral game from Fire Blaster. Dash Dancing back and forth, making sure Spongy's got a guess when he comes in. Nice, solid couple of nares into the down air. It's not going to kill yet, but Fire Blaster put him in the edge guard position. Nice. Bungie going to lose that stock. And just like that, folks, that's why these guys are playing such a tight neutral. They do not want to just get caught into these terrible, terrible positions and get these stocks lost. That's just insane. But literally just like that, we're all tied up. Nice forward throw into the reverse bicycle kick. Oh, unfortunately, that downer did not connect. Well, a falcon kick? What is that option? Has that always been an option? Or am I just new? 
I'm, I mean, I'm new, but come on. That Falcon Kick was out there. And he's showing him his moves. He's making sure Spongy knows exactly what moves are on the table here. Up B. Not going to get punished for it. That was a really, actually, interesting trade. That Town Tilt sending Fire Blaster straight left. All right. Nice move by Spongy. Falcon Punch. Make sure his recovery is not too... Uh, Oh, that's not going to kill yet, but he's getting real close to kill percent. Bungie sneezes on him the wrong way. Fire Blaster is going to lose his stock. Again, Fire Blaster is seeing a lot of empty jumps. I like that. Making, making Spongy guess what he's going to do next. But just like that, a back air is going to connect. All right, all right, all right. Spongy now off stage, set up for the edge guard. Let's see if uh, Fire Blaster can't take hold of this. Nice coverage with the freaking forward air. Now Fire Blaster is the one in edge guard position. Recovers high, super smart option. Tries the Falcon Punch and that's it. Game two, going to Spongy. I like the Falcon Punch coverage because you know if it if it hit, it was good. If it hit, Spongy was most likely not dead, but it gave uh, Fire Blaster the opportunity to get back to stage, regain the stage control. It was, it was a good option. I enjoyed it. All right. So, game three. This is a three out of five, so we gotta win two more games. Let's see what happens here. Fire Blaster still sticking with the Falcon. I like that decision. He's been doing very well with this. All right. Fire Blaster just kind of working his way in. He's got Spongy on the ropes right now. Just like that, that down there is gonna take that stock. Spongy, unfortunately, not able to fight back from those ropes. Ooh, I like the up tilt. I respect it. I respect the up tilt. All right. Good stuff by Spongy. Yeah, unfortunately, the Falcon Punch just not able to get him the uh, distance he needed. Oh, right. ooh. Head down here. Spongy's able to come back with all these jumps. Ooh. The hug intercepting that. Not too bad, but now Fire Blast is in the awkward position here. Wow, the reverse down tilt just didn't get around in time. Bungie trying his best. Oh, okay. I can I can respect that option. Fire Blast has been doing a pretty good job at uh, down airing those, but it, it worked out this time. He had no other choice, really. Falcon Punch. Mm, again, just getting punished on his return to stage. Very close, and just like that, the downer is going to connect and slide him off stage. Get out of here. Gets clipped with that up tilt, and that's it. The vortex of up tilts is just terrible. 60% racked up in just four moves. Up air is coming in hot. Up B, going to connect. That's going to kill. Again, Fire Blaster making sure all moves are shown. Requesting that more moves be shown. How are you just going to request more moves from this man? Okay. Not able to connect on that Nair. That could be big. Fire Blaster now put in an awkward spot. Nair. Down tilts. Down tilts more. Fire Blaster doing a great job of teching in. The down air, though, going to spike him back to the Shadow Realm. On. Bungie now off stage. Let's see. Fire Blaster not able to get that down air. Not what he wanted. And this could be bad for Fire Blaster. This could be game three. I want to sponge you, but we'll see. Wow, the up air not connecting. I, I expected a back air in all of its glory. Lord, nice tech away. Spongy not really able to react to that. At least not in a safe manner. Fire Blaster now again fighting back from the ropes here. Back air going to connect. That's going to be it. Wow. Game three, going to Fire Blaster. Good job. Good job by Fire Blaster. That was, uh, it's pretty tough. I mean, both these guys can take a stock out of one hit at this point. The Fire Blaster swapping costumes now. He says, the Dark Falcon's too much for me. I'm going with the light, uh, with the Blue Falcon now. I'm going with the original color skin. I like it. 
Firebuster most likely has the same game plan. He wants to make sure he utilizes the movement option, get the neutral game. Hopefully not get too punished in the meantime. Gotta watch those up tilts and back airs though. He's getting hit by a lot of them right now. Nice up air string. This could be big. Up air is off the top platform. Up B. That's not going to kill yet. Got him from the middle of the stage. So. Bungie coming back down to coming back down to earth here. I was not able to convert off that trade, but the up air, though, we're going to take him barely off the top. Again, requesting more moves. I don't know what to do about this. Bungie's saying, I'm all out of moves, man. Or is he? What kind of moves do he have in his bag of tricks? Firebuster, no jump. That's it. Gonna be a stock. He says, all right, I'll show you a move. A down tilt. So Spongy keeping it close, tying the game, whole game up so far. Ooh, that's it. Yeah, Fireblaster down two stocks now, just easily like that. Getting clipped on his jump with those up tilts. This is a really close game so far. Spongy's got a little bit of a lead, but we've seen this multiple times. One hit, dead. There it is. Fire Blaster. Looking a little bit softer this game. Unfortunate. Seems like Spongy has pretty good control over where he wants to be this game. Looking to take this to a game five. Fire Blaster hunting this man down. He says, no Kirby's. In my grands. Out of here. All right. Spongy. Still in a bit of a lead here. Let's see if Firebuster can tie this up with this one little combo. Back here, whiffing. Oh! Unfortunate. Fire Blaster goes a little bit too far down. It gets clipped with the down air. That spikes him all the way down. 2-2. Two, two. Game five. Fire Blaster going to the Pikachu now. I like the switch up. Keep him guessing a little bit. Bungie trying to start a fire in his hands, making sure that they're all nice and warmed up. Pikachu wearing the party hat. I like it. If you don't wear a party hat, Kirby, uh, Pikachu, maybe you're even really playing the game. So, Spongy definitely knows his matchup. He plays Kaz a lot. Um, he definitely plays Fire Blaster Kirby a lot, so we'll see. Fire Blaster has to be confident in this, in this, in this pick here. I just started like four times in a row. Uh, he's keeping it close. It's definitely not like this is one sided so far with this first stock. Back air that's going to connect. That's going to most likely not kill. Yeah. Oh, Pikadim. Get him with the freaking down B. The thunder. The thunder. There it is. Ooh, hit him with thunder three times. He's thunderstruck. All right. Please pardon me. Uh, I'm just solo commentating. Anything I say. Oh! Uh, there we go. Bungie, after that insane taunt, tying it up. Oh, tried again with the ladder combos. Worked out really well. It racked on a lot of percent and force speed drop space. Only one zip. I like it. Mixing it up. Two zips. Keeping it fresh. Pikachu. Not dead yet. Next throw. Next real real tough move is going to kill, though. Let's see. Fire Blaster trying to get something started. No. Misses that up air again. Unfortunate. Let's clip with the Nair. Keeping Spongy on his toes. Up airs for days. Ooh, that's tough. Unfortunately, not able to finish it off and losing a stock because of it. Down tilt. Or that was a forward tilt. I don't know. There it is. Most likely not dead yet. Oh, okay. Never mind. Never mind what I said. All right. Bungie keeping it going, though. Up tilts. Trying to get him with a little bit of a uh, pillar combos here. Not able to get, though. Bad Blaster getting him off stage. Exactly where he wants Spongy. <laughs> now he's the one off stage. All right, again, keeping it simple. One zip, two zips, and gets down, uh, down aired. Bungie, he says, I want to go to grand finals. 
This is the last stock on this Pikachu. Can he do it? Getting the up tilt, the vortex. Fire Blaster trying to play this neutral as best he can. He's got to take this one stock before he gets too much extra credit. Manages to zip out of there though. Spongy on the hunt. On the hunt for one more stock and he's hungry. He's got a family to feed and he's serving up Fire Blaster stocks. Is he able to get it though? Oh, bad trade for Fire Blaster. Manages to just barely get back with Spongy. Flying in wait. What does he got? Ooh, nice Nair to cover that option. Spongy looking to do something else, but almost dead here. Fire Blaster, there we go. Connects with the back here. Let's see what he can't do. He's got one stock left to work with. Yeah. Let's see what happens. Spongy. Again, on the hunt for this last stock, and that's going to be it. He gets the grab, and that connects. Spongy going to Grand Finals, dude. You missed all the good stuff, but you're I on. know. You're here. Came just in time. Yeah. What's going on? Uh, not a lot. Just kind of, I showed up late because I came here with Dom. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Unfortunately, but, uh, but at least you guys are here, man. We we're always here. appreciate everyone coming down. Yeah, absolutely. But uh, how's this? Uh, how's the bracket for 64 going? 